tradition not to be taught Shakespeare. Because Shakespeare didn't teach us, he instructed us. He taught us to feel. And this generation's gotta learn to feel because this generation don't feel nothing. That's why our kids can shoot each other and don't feel nothing because there is no beauty in their lives. Because there is no beauty in their lives. They say one death is a tragedy, but 26 is a statistic. They say, dog bites man ain't a story, try. Man bites dog. I say at a carnival, people line up single file with their heavy wallets in their hand to gaze upon a snake and a mouse doing their little dance. Ooh, ah, man bites dog. And God made us just smart enough to spend the backwards hours spinning in our own heads about how to fix the world, how to save the mouse, how to stop the snake, but in the end, I get in line like everybody else. Adam Peter Lanza, April 22, 1992, the biggest killer since, no, that's not right. Brother says he was autistic, no, mild Asperger's, but line up to see the murderer, line up to see the snake, pay a buck in Sandy Hook for a look at death, carnival performer. Maybe every generation feels like the new one is decaying, but maybe it's true too. Because 2012 will always be a young white kid collapsed in a bathroom stall with a needle in his arm, smiling saliva onto the tiles of white. And 2012 will always be an iPhone strapped to his face with a snake and a mouse doing their little dance. And 2012 will always be 26 gravestones, lined up serene by the side of the ocean in my tears and my fear. The sound of 40 little feet and 20 little dreams, not knowing they would end up what's injected into the addict's arm. Not knowing they would dance with a body electric on the empty streets of my soul. North America's gone cold because the purest stories, the whitest stories, the ones we need are never told. But I'm in line like everybody else. My tongue don't work so well. And sometimes that snake makes my heart beat a little bit faster and sometimes that bathroom stall and that needle feels like a golden throne and a royal wand, but somehow I wish we could kill our TVs. Stop the replay, replay, repeat of their screams and take some time to walk in the sand past their gravestones. North America's grown cold because the purest stories, the whitest stories, the ones we need are never told. There is no growing old on the immortal screen and there are no dreams left because this generation don't feel nothing. That's why our kids can shoot each other and don't feel nothing because there is no beauty in their lives. Because there is no beauty in their lives. Thank you.